What's up guys, Filion here, back with another banger. If you're new around here, I'm the relatable cool commentary channel who uploads daily and doesn't have a soul. Don't forget to lightly tap that subscribe button. You don't want to go around pressing it too hard. This is what you've been waiting for. Episode 10, season three of The Reality House. It's the season finale. Over the past two months, we've been making Reality House content. And for some of you, it's a blessing. For others, you probably don't even watch my channel anymore because I've been posting so many videos. But hear me out. I am so deep in the Reality House lore at this point, it would be a mortal sin to not cover the last episode. And that's exactly what we're here to do. The last episode is titled, The Winner of the Reality House is... Dot, dot, dot. That means in this episode, we're going to find out who wins all the beans, who takes all the marbles, who walks away with over $35,000 plus their own bank account. It's not chump change we're talking about. You see, Keen and JC have really upped the ante in terms of prize money. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I did not spoil the ending to this show. This is the first time I'm watching the finale along with you guys. And by the looks of it, it's going to be a long one. So buckle up. I mean, this video is one hour and 33 seconds long. Okay. So if you come at me like, Phil, where are the 20 minute videos? I'm sorry. This is what we're working with. It's also 1130 at night, which means I'm going to need some energy. Thanks to today's video sponsor, G Fuel. This will get me feeling right, if you know what I mean. Just a little something to take the edge off. <laughs> Right now, I'm sipping on Shiny Splash, which is easily one of my favorite flavors. Use code Filion at gfuel.com to get up to 30% off your order. Massive thank you to G Fuel for supporting these videos. Previously on Reality House. This is our last challenge. Are you crying? What? Is she crying? I'm literally freaking out, like, really bad. I'm panicking. I, I, I can't breathe. Welcome to Reality House Season 3, the season finale. We were left off with all of the contestants taking turns to complete the final challenge, which has two parts, the maze and the Zorb Ball. In the maze, you have to scramble around and find the letters. Once you get out of the maze, you have to spell the right word, which happened to be thousand. And we saw so many people struggle with this basic word. And the Zorb Ball is one big hamster race. I mean, it's elementary stuff. Come on here. I'm trying to stay positive, trying to hype myself up. I'm like reminding myself like, you got this, you got this, you got this, but this is so annoying. I'm literally freaking out, like really bad. I am inside of this hamster ball thing right now. Um, my heart's going like this and suddenly I'm nervous. Oh, that's right. Haley had some sort of panic attack because she burned all of her energy leapfrogging inside of this big balloon ball. I mean, come on, what are we doing here? I'm freaking out and I'm panicking. I, I, I can't breathe, it's hot. I cannot find the hole I'm supposed to get out of and I'm try I need, I need out. <sighs> She's scrambling around trying to find the porthole on the goddamn thing. I can breathe. So I'm deciding to bail out right now. I'm freaking out and I know it's a time challenge, but I know I'm gonna kill the next challenge because it's involving words and I'm good at words. She's not lying there. I mean, she absolutely killed the last word challenge. This is Rain Man Haley. There's a small anxiety attack. No, you're good, you're good. Very, very close. Uh, need some water? Yeah. Okay. I did not know I had such big claustrophobia. It's so small in there. I got super scared for a second. I said, get out of there. I guess I have claustrophobia. What does claustrophobic mean? It means he's afraid of Santa Claus. No, it doesn't. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> um, I hope someone I like wins. Oh no, Haley. Oh no, Haley. You gave it your all. Don't give up. We are rooting for you. Now, let's see how Louie is doing.
Again? Nobody can crack this word. Bro, they're playing real life Wordle out here. Nobody can get this word. It's thousand. It's not that hard. Put the TH together and figure out the rest. Am I wrong, man? <laughs> like, how many options do you have? They're all staring at it like... <gasps> then again, they are LA influencers, so, you know. I feel like I kind of gave up. Like, I was just looking at these words and I was like... What is this? I could not come up with anything. I just felt so dumb. Yeah, you should. No, I'm just playing. I like Louie. I hope he wins. And like, how can I just not put this simple word together? I'm actually really excited about the Zorb. Um, I've never done one before. Always wanted to do one. So yeah, I mean, it looks pretty exciting. I think I'll be pretty good at it. Listen, I know the stuffed animal may be necessary, but it's gotta hinder performance. I know we're not dealing with champions here, because I would absolutely yeet that stuffed animal out of my ass crack. It would give me the worst swamp ass with the LA hot sun beaming down through a giant magnifying glass. I would be slipping and sliding around this thing. Like, just throw it away! I might have a full-blown panic attack, so just be, be prepared for that. And I might shit a little, so get some underwear ready. So I'm seeing a lot of reactions from the other people before they do the maze, and they come back and they don't look too happy. And I'm not, I'm smart, but I'm not that smart. Yeah, we know. Gonna make me bring back the old me. Yeah. How you gonna roast me in the homie? Anything that requires using my brain usually doesn't go well for me, so I'm not sure how I feel about this. I'm actually really nervous. Time starts in three, two, I'm walking in. One. Let's get it, baby. Is he walking? Yeah, you have a time trial. Let me just walk. My goodness, so much is happening right now. I can barely keep up. This ball stinks. It is as hot as a sauna, and I feel like I'm literally going to vomit. Is it gonna, oh, no, okay. Gotta ask questions, here we go. Got one. Gotcha, bitch. Gotcha, bitch. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Gotcha, bitch. I'm running through this maze, and the amount of adrenaline rushing through me, like, I really feel like I'm dead ass in a movie. I'm like around every corner, like, oh, oh, oh. Tell me how much adrenaline is rushing through to your brain right now. <laughs> You're not a tunnel rat in World War I, buddy. <laughs> You're in an oasis in the middle of a California desert competing for money. Oh, man, the adrenaline, it was just, wow. Gotcha, bitch! How many? Eight? F I was just over here, huh? Oh no, Zach. Seems like you're having trouble finding that last piece. I wish I could give you a hint myself, mate. Holy shit. Oh my gosh. I think I'm gonna throw up. Bro, Taylor did that no problem. You know, just take it nice and easy. One foot in front of the other. Everyone else is like, ah, where's the porthole? Ah. I can't describe why that was so hard, but that was really hard. <sighs> Jeez, they are not messing around on season three. Now that's something we can all agree on. Do I have eight? Oh, my ass there. Let's go, eh? see my dyslexic ass can spell. For a minute I struggled because I felt like I was just doing circles and I could not find the last one. All right, we're gonna set them all out real nice and pretty. Okay, this is a lot harder than I thought it was gonna be. Is it? Did you guys never do like a vocab quiz? Or like a spelling bee? You only text in Zoomer hieroglyphics. You know what? Why don't we just play it together? Comment down below a word that is scrambled and I'll try to unscramble it. I want all of you guys to do it. So then when other people come and watch this video eight years from now, because Filion is a legendary YouTuber by then, they're going to be like, what the fuck is wrong with this comment section? I'm kind of excited because there are no bugs. Might do okay. It's individual, which is really great. And feeling semi hopeful, but also super nervous. Yep. <laughs> I hate everything. I literally hate everything. Oh, this is kind of fun. Man, 
man, I don't know how to spell this is bad. Okay. I've definitely never heard of this word in my life. There's just no shot. I have like literally no idea at all. Like again, I'm on like a third grade reading level, so like, you know, I had no fucking idea what it was. No shot. It's just no shot. Oh my god, Jim Shark boy is at it again. He's wearing Jim Shark shorts, man. I'm not allowed to give up, am I? That's a trick question. I'm not giving up. That's right, Zach. Don't give up. It looks like Camila sure hasn't. Honestly, I thought it was gonna be a little harder. I've got really long limbs, so kind of killing it, I think, maybe. Bro, those cones don't do anything. If that's hindering your Zorb ball, you're already lost. You think those little traffic cones would stop me? Mm, yo, shot. What are those cute little traffic cones going to do when 215 muscle bound Filion plows through this course? I don't know. Maybe it's the long limbs that help, but uh, I'm tired. I feel okay. Oh, my God. I'm so tired. I feel okay. She literally like, yeah, it was really not that bad. All of you are dramatic. Okay. Yeah. All of you are children. I don't even know how to be strategic with this. Like I feel like, oh, fuck, man. Yeah, I'm done. I'm done for you. This ain't happening. All right, Zach. Unfortunately, you have reached maximum time. <sighs> all right, I'm gonna try my hardest. That's all I can do. I'm not surprised that the time ran out and I didn't get it. Not surprised at all. Very mad though. Not even mad. Just kind of overwhelmed and upset because I feel defeated, honestly. Like, I tried my hardest, I really did, but it just was not working out for me. I tried. No, you gave up, buddy. Listen, to all of you out there who have anything going on and you think about giving up, you're weak, you're sad, you're a puss boy. I'm just playing. <laughs> no, I'm not. Honestly, I have one rule. Never, never, never give up. I am gonna win. I like Taylor's energy right now. Positive mindset. I'm the fucking beast. I'm Taylor. Now it's time for the maze. Um, I know it has something to do with solving a word, which I feel pretty confident in. I'm pretty good with like word solving, but it's also already made someone cry. So I'm a little bit worried about what it all entails. I don't know if they have any surprises that are gonna pop out, but all in all, I'm feeling pretty confident. Literally just a word. I think you got this. Yes. Time starts. Let's see if all that confidence pays off for Taylor in this grueling maze. Right. Yo, my guy Ken, what's up, dude? No, I'm fucking vibing out right now, dude. Yo, Kane is crushing it. Oh my God. Too bad he couldn't solve the word, man. So I'm doing this hamster ball thing, and um, to be honest, pretty easy. Much easier than the maze. I have absolutely no strategy or technique whatsoever. I am just running as fast as I can, looking around every corner and grabbing every single letter I can. Talk about giving it your all. I must say, I'm impressed, Kane. This man absolutely smoked that course, but is it impressive or are we just getting weak performances by other people? Not bad, eh? Not bad. There you go, man. <laughs> oh. <sighs> Believe in me, guys. I think we got this. No one's getting that fucking word, I swear to God. Hmm, are you sure about that, Kane? Nah, that's where you're wrong. Christian, your arch nemesis, already solved that shit. Yeah, it was thousand. Go figure. <laughs> Yo, shout out my boy Christian CV. Shout out my boy Christian CV over on Twitter. Follow me at Third Eye of Truth if you know what's good for you. No, it is cool when people from the show actually enjoy watching me react to their show. Sick. I wonder if Taylor has anything to say about that. Let's go Taylor one time! I have all eight 
letters finally. I, I make it out of the maze. I'm, I'm assembling the letters and I'm trying my best to, you know, it's already off to a little bit of a confusing start, but I think, I think I can figure it out. I definitely think I can figure it out. Shut down? <laughs> that one got me. <laughs> She's funny. Um. Oh. Oh, oh my gosh, I got it. It's handouts. Like, they're gonna hand out the money to me. Handouts. What? Oh, oh wait, it's not, it's actually, it's not handouts. I'm just a genius and came up with another word that these letters spell out. Oh, Taylor, always figuring out loopholes on the show. So at this point I see O-U-S and I'm like, ows. Oh, ah! I see the TH, it all comes together, it's thousand. Yes, let's go! Yeah! I feel like she's gonna win. She just crushed both of those challenges. Thousand. Thousand. Correct. <sighs> Thank you. Okay. Oh no, E's here, man. She's gonna see that you got the word and go into oblivion again. Just open up a portal and cry for eternity. Got this. Just gotta keep my head cool. It's all fine. Oh my god. Whoa. This is crazy. What if she has Vietnam flashbacks, actual PTSD from misspelling the word inside the Zorb bowl? Now that is a recipe for disaster. Camila, E, you've made it this far, girls. Let's see how much fight you've got left in you. Oh, how am I still? I swear to God. I cannot find all these letters. I feel like I keep going down the same path, and I'm looking for the one that I am not going down. I cannot find it. I hate this maze. Now, I might be an actual genius, but if I was in this maze, I would just jump and look, scout real quick, if I hit those corridors or not. Use your noggin, man. What, is JC gonna come out of the woodwork being like, nah, you're disqualified. Well, you didn't clarify that in the rules. I swear to God, if it wasn't this whole stupid maze. That's quite the roadblock you've got there, K and J. So I'm in this Zorb and it is so hot. I'm trying to run around. Oh my God, here we go again, man. Another sob story about how somebody can't finish the race. Pick yourselves up and push through. And you never really know like how fast you're actually going when you're doing the challenges. Push through it. You've got this. Oh, it's gonna make me mad. This is gonna make me mad. <laughs> ah, I got it. Hey. Okie dokie. What do we have? <sighs> I've got all the letters out, and my brain is mush. I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. I all vowels in one word. My first move would be to put the TH together, <laughs> followed by a vowel. <laughs> the guy just keeps rolling her around the course. <laughs> She's on tumble dry setting. E, I know today hasn't been easy for you, but you did it. Ah, this commentator, man. You did it. Oh. I'm so out of breath, oh my god. Oh. That was hard. That was hard. I can't, I got stuck here. It was hard, but that was fun. It's 
can only put some little words together. My time's running out and honestly feeling screwed. Yeah? Well, it's been fun. This game. You know how you make the hardest season four of the reality house? Just literally do a spelling bee. Uh, so my time ran out, feeling very <laughs> disappointed in myself. Very stupid, might be time to go back to school. I feel damn good about the maze right now. I gotta say I'm team Christian right now. He's the only one who displayed not only athletic ability, but had the brain power to put the words together, man. Walking down, hamster ball, it's more of an athletic challenge and I've been working out, so I feel damn good. Let's get it. I'm athletic. And there's this big old hamster ball in front of me and I feel like I can get the momentum. I feel like it's an easy win on this one. Quick time. You're athletic, hmm, Christian? Okay, my foot just fell in the hole. Buddy, please. <laughs> I'm rooting for you! I got some ideas for the next season, if I ever react to it. Me and a bunch of other YouTubers throw in some money, betting on who's gonna win. Now that is content. Yeah, I got eight grand on Christian winning. I don't have the momentum to get over this wall. I need to step back. It's hurting my time, but I still feel like I have this. breath that shit sucks but i feel really goddamn good right now everybody said that was exhausting as hell i feel like i could have gone another like three laps i feel good that's it for me <sighs> okay let's do this yo shout out lava girl my favorite twitch streamer let's go today we're gonna play some among us <laughs> oh, i'm sorry so next I have to do the maze, the puzzle, and I'm super nervous as well because the people who did it before me were coming out just super defeated. But at the same time, I do feel pretty confident about it. Yo, where's my boy Fousey at? Where's Fousey Tube? Where's Mr. Chrome Dome himself? Hey, you, you're finally awake. Ooh, Brad. Hello, Mr. Brad. Is this my good luck charm? Yes. Oh, Brad. <laughs> I'm getting weird vibes, man. You already know something went down. <laughs> Will Brad and his good luck charm be enough to help Mariah conquer the maze? All right, good luck. Watch Brad just be like a turbo virgin. He's all about abstinence. Do not tempt me with hedonistic pleasures, you succubus. Lava Girl's just like, what the fuck? Okay, 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 okay. I'm getting ready for this puzzle challenge. Huh, mate. And I just cannot help but to think that there's some twist when you get in there. I think that we're gonna start this thing off and there's gonna be fucking letters flying out of a helicopter into my hand. I gotta, I don't, I don't know. I just know there's gonna be some K and J twist that I am not ready for. Bro, it's been two episodes and all of the contestants are still not done with this challenge. I'm ready. I like the confidence. I'm gonna win a million dollars. A million dollars? Have you been paying attention at all, Haley? Your time starts in three, two, one. Bro, Lava Girl is booking it. Peter is booking it. That's, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Meanwhile, Haley looks like she's in a haunted house and she's scared to turn the corner. Peter's bobbing and weaving, ducking in and out. He's getting to the finish line. I'm in the maze right now. I am struggling to find these letters because obviously it's a maze and there's a cameraman everywhere. Getting a little bit complicated. So I'm zooming through the maze. I'm getting super stressed out because I keep forgetting which places I had already checked. Okay. 
Okay, calm and collected. Yes! All right, three. What's eight minus three? One, two, three, four. I have seven letters right now, but I'm thinking this could be the twist. Maybe I have to spell something and that's the clue for the eighth letter. I, I don't know. I'm overthinking this right now. I swear every time this man does a challenge, he forgets something back at the starting line. Peter takes the cake for just choking at the wrong moments. Oh shit. One, two, three. I swear to God, the fing. If I can count correctly, this is eight. I got all the letters. I have eight letters, and it's gonna take me just a couple seconds to get this. My first initial reaction is just throw everything on the ground, and then I remember, oh my god, I gotta go on the table. So I put it on the table, and the table seems like it's six feet long, and I can't see that far because I'm just short and small. Oh, shit! Okay. I find the letter, boom, okay. Got it all mapped out, eight letters. What the f does that spell? T-H, let's try that. No, I already did that, okay. Maybe S-H, a shoulder? F this is a lot harder than I thought. F I feel like I'm losing so much time here and I just need to get myself collected and focused. Nay, fuss, noth, nast, nasted. B, what is this? Oh my god, I, I, I should have paid attention in class. Asshole. I'm not giving up yet, I just have zero idea. I should have gone to college. Dude, according to Gary V, nobody should go to college. That's why I'm proud of my degree, man. I could spell words. <laughs> I'm panicking, there's, I have no idea what this word is. My time is running out. This is not looking good. I don't know what this spells, I'm freaking out. And honestly, I'm not even thinking right now. I'm, there's too much going on in my head to even imagine what this word spells. Tan, Tana. Yeah, it's just Tana Mojo. <laughs> Tana, is this about Tana leaving? No, there's no A. I don't know what the f word is. How am I this stupid? Can I pay for a hint? Right, Ailey, unfortunately, that is our maximum time. Okay, honestly relieved. Dang it! Bye. <laughs> Once I took a second to step back and just take a breath, I realized it was right in front of me. Thousand. That's correct. <sighs> Let's go! Let's go! Lava Girl solving the Da Vinci code? Let's go! Yeah, baby, let's go. I figured it out. I didn't even need that much time, and I am super stoked to see what the results are. How do I figure it out as I'm leaving without the letters in front of me? Literally just thinking about a couple of the letters, I go, thousand. Ugh, if I just close my eyes for a second, I really concentrated, man. It's, it's just, it was just too hectic in there. Yet again, Haley, you have failed. Way to go, Mariah. You really crushed it out there. Who's Mariah? It's Lava Girl. Now that the first half of the day has ended, let's see what else K and J have up their sleeves for the finale. I feel good. I worked really hard in those challenges. I, I completed the puzzle. I did the Zorb thing pretty well. I feel like I'm a top contender right now. It makes me, it feels good. I feel like shit. <laughs> I don't know. Thought I was gonna do a lot better on the maze part. Um, not feeling very hopeful. <laughs> Second time's a charm. I know they usually say third time's a charm, but they're not gonna bring me back for a third season. So let's say a prayer that second time's a charm and I don't come in second place. I come in first place this time. Okay, contestants, welcome to the finale. Look at these two swag lords over here. K and J, man, tripped out. And the final part of the finale. This is the final part of the this finale. Is the end. This is the finale's finale. Hey. Okay, guys, um, as you all know, you all have individual accounts, all right? Some big, some very small, some bankrupt. <laughs> so, Ke and I are really nice people. And we, right? wanna, and we wanna give you more money. We wanna give you more money for your accounts. The sponsors just gave us way too much money, so, you know, tax write-offs, am I right? <laughs> this is JC whenever he flips an NFT. Okay. So, you guys are gonna have the opportunity to win $25,000 to your bank Wait, why is that my, why is that got my name on it? Bro, <laughs> where is he getting this money from? <laughs>
Everyone will get their own little baggy bag. Okay. All right, so let me explain the rules. The reason we're keeping you in here because we don't want any cheating. We want any strategy being given, okay? Outside we have a money tunnel. Grabber. What's yeah, it called? A money tunnel grabber. It's one of those things where the money flies around like this, muy rápido, and you have to grab it from the air. <laughs> oh God. They should do a season of the reality house where it's just homeless people. <laughs> Patty, I don't, I don't know if that's like too funny or like too fucked up, but instead we just have LA influencers with probably already a lot of money. Nah, you're good, dude. As literally someone who was homeless for six months during the recession growing up, that was funny. I would have made the same joke straight up. <laughs> of KJ's money tunnel, uh, and you have the, you have the opportunity to win all of it if you grab all of it. We're gonna be pulling you one by one. And uh, the little K and J that we have is on each little piece of paper. There is either a plus or a minus. Shit. It's kidding. So, um, what the plus or minus means? If you have a plus symbol on your money, that means you get plus thirty seconds added to your total time. If you have the minus symbol. Subtract 30 seconds from your total time. Another game of RNG, random number generator. It's all luck, unless you like look at each bill like, huh? plus or minus, Woo. I feel like I killed the other two competitions today and all I could think was, less might be more in this situation if my time is really good, but if everyone else's objective is to get as much as they can, I have to do the same thing because I don't know what the results will be. I'm actually really excited for the money pit. This means I still have a chance. I love grabbing dinero, so I'm like, you know what? I got this, I'm gonna try my absolute best. I'm glad we have one final thing, not to do the money grab, and I feel like maybe, just maybe, I could come in the top three. So since I... Yeah, nobody cares, Wraith. I'm stoked. I'm super stoked because, to be honest, the game's completely changed. You know, I don't care that I fucking lost the maze now. Let's do it. My strategy going in is that I have absolutely no strategy going in. All I'm going to do is grab as much money as humanly possible and shove it in my pants as fast as I can. The goal is to get as much money as possible because you want... You see that shit? Because you want... <laughs> They're kissing. I can't hear anything. Oh. To my money talk, the money talk, baby. So if I just grab a bunch of minuses, technically that would help me. We made the minuses and pluses so small you won't even notice. Yeah. No, yeah, but like I'm saying, like if you were to grab the a bunch minus of minuses, will help you. And you yeah. basically want to avoid the pluses. You want to avoid the pluses. You can't avoid them. Yeah, but they're so small. If uh, you add time, my contacts. if you add time to your time, that's just gonna make that time more time. You're It's got a point. You're gonna wanna grab as much money as possible, okay? In the wind tunnel, you will have one minute to grab as much money as possible. Every $100 you bring out of the KJ's money tunnel, it will be added to your account, yes. So if you leave with $5,000 in your hand, we will add $5,000 to your total amount. But we will add and subtract that time that was also on the money. It's on an every dollar bill. It's not an every dollar bill. Just grab everything. All right, we're gonna start this challenge right now. We're gonna pull one of you and get it started. Who's first? Who's first, mate? Ah! Oh, the money challenge. Oh, no, that's wait. You don't need this money. All right, Peter, come with us. Capitalism. Come on, us. Wait, can I take my hoodie? Or no hoodie? The pluses and minuses are so small that you're not going to be able to, in the moment, be able to tell which ones you're picking up. So I know your best bet is just to just grab what you can. It's still anybody's game. Let's go. At the end of the day. These hands, look at them, okay? Look at them. Ginormous. They have all these tiny ass influencer hands that are good for texting. These money grabber 9000s wouldn't even be a fair competition. And it all comes down to this. You, yeah, you put it wherever you want in any crevice. Just make sure they're in your hands after and then you're gonna drop them in a bucket and we'll count them after, okay? You must grab it from the air. Okay, you get one minute. Your minute starts in three, two, one. Go! Holy shit, money's coming out of everywhere. I'm trying to just scoop as much money into my pants as I can. There you go, doing good, doing good. Kick up more. Stop. Keep going, keep going. 
stuffing them up in my bra, you know, like I was trying to find every crevice, anything tight, I could stick it anywhere. She's gripping it with her toes. Look at that monkey grip. Rawr! Gripping it like a tree branch. Bring it in, grab stuff. Bring it in, grab stuff. 30 more seconds! Money's flying everywhere. I'm not really sure what my tactic is here. Get as much as you can! Keep going, keep going! I'm still just waiting for Fousey Tube to- <gasps> Kool-Aid man through there, steal all the money. Where's my boy at? Let's go, Haley. let's go. K and JC just doing the victory dance, dude. We're so fucking rich. Oh my God. <laughs> I just love money. Don't you love money? Oh, I fucking love money. Just grab as much money as I can. Let's go, Simba. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Stop. Oh my God, that's Ooh. a lot. <laughs> Whatever you have. Please step out. All right, come on out and put all your money in this bucket, please. Oh my God. They all just drop trout, take steamy dumpers in there. Where do I come up with this, man? What folder did I just grab that from in my brain? I think I did incredible. The bonds that I've made and the way that my presence here has impacted the people here is more than I could have ever asked for. And at the end of the day, win or lose, I know that I, was gifted the opportunity to come back here and compete, which is what I love to do. And I'm just feeling super blessed and humbled. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. I didn't think it was gonna be easy, but I didn't think it was gonna be hard either. I didn't know what the f it was gonna be, honestly. That definitely was a game changer. But I, I, think, I, I think I'm doing well. Uh, I feel pretty good. I know that there's some stuff written down on these bills and I didn't really look. So I don't know how to feel. I don't know if it's good or bad or what, but. Hopefully I did a good job. What if you just grab one bill? Is that some galaxy brain shit? Or would you just lose by default? <laughs> I didn't have enough time to strategize, but I think that I have enough dumb luck that I got this in the bag and I'm gonna get the bag of money. What you got going on in there, Christian? I grabbed a lot of money. I don't know if that's good. I don't know if that's bad, but my fingers are crossed and my prayers are going up. To be honest with you, I don't know how I did. I grabbed a lot, but I had no idea if it's a plus or minus, so we'll see. We'll have to see. Not too sure of where I came in overall. Hopefully made top three. I got a lot, I got a whole, I got a lot of work. I'm feeling pretty good, honestly. I stuffed my pantalones. I was nice and stuffed. I even have some like in my shirt, my pockets. So I'm like, I'm praying that this is gonna make the difference. Money. You, that was good. For free? Oh my uh, God. <laughs> Lava girl with all the Twitch Prime subs. Look at all that money, dude. Once again, I feel pretty good about it. I have a good feeling about today's competitions and I filled my pants up to the point where it looked like I had a fupa, so I felt good about that. They're tallying up the times right now. And I genuinely believe that there is a spot up there for me, either one, two, or three, but I, I'm i gonna stick to that. Watch out for the After the wind tunnel, I felt really great. I, um, I think I did. Pretty okay, but at this point, it's anyone's game. Yeah. Cool. Oh, wait, no. Damn. And they sneak up on you like that. Now that everyone's times have been locked in, the contestants are eager and ready for the final ceremony to begin. Final ceremony, man. This is what we've been waiting for. Nine episodes of dramatic events all leading up to this very moment. We're gonna find out who wins the reality house. Look at this! They're all glammed up, all dapper-like. Are you kidding me? I am sorry. I apologize for this filth I'm wearing. Some of you probably can't even see this. Let me slip into something more appropriate. Yeah, ah, it's more like it. Ha <laughs> okay, ha bro. It's showtime. I know that it, a lot of it's gonna come down to the dollar bills that we scooped up in that last little K and J twist. I'm feeling nervous, um, but like good nerves. Really excited to see who's gonna win for sure. Does I feel good? 
I look good. I killed it in the maze. I killed it in the ball. Christian with the rock cosplay. Look at this man. The thin chain with the turtleneck. I see you. Yeah, I see you. I'm super freaking excited, but I'm also really freaking nervous. We are finding out who made it in the top five, and I'm pretty confident in myself that I'm there, so. I'm a lot more nervous than I was like 30 minutes ago, because I know this is the big moment. This is where we figure out who, who's taking it home, who's winning. This man's wearing a blanket, dude. Hello, contestants. Hello. 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 You all look really good. Tell me something I don't know. That being said, welcome to Reality House season three, the ceremony. How are you guys feeling? Nervous. Anxious. Nervous. 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 Alrighty guys. So before we get into uh, the winners and the losers, we want to go over the banks of each of you. Our last challenge, the finale, uh, we gave away $50,000, okay? First place will get 35,000 added to their account. Second place gets 10 and third place gets five. But first place is the only one walking away with 35,000 plus their bank. Let's start from the lowest. With $3,700, we got Christian. Damn, I grabbed oh. some cash in that machine. Yeah. Hey, I hope that didn't buy me in there. Not bankrupt. With, uh, with 6,500, goes to Peter. Patty, just throw an infinity symbol above my head because let's be honest, that would be my bank account in this show. $9,700 in their account. E. All right. That's a lot of money. Whatever. Uh, <laughs> we got $10,900 for Kane. Oh, nice. That's a good amount, that's Kane, a good, boy. That's a good chunk. All right. This account has $13,300. Who does it belong to? It belongs to Zach. Oh, it's a lot of money, Playboy, of course, boy. How about we just don't call him Playboy? Uh, with $13,900 for Haley. That's a lot of money. Oh, that's a lot of money, Haley. A okay. lot of money. $15,900. Louie. That's a lot of money, baby. Yeah. I was not expecting that, honestly. <laughs> with $16,700 for Taylor. Dance, you got dance. I had $3,000 yesterday. Um, with just $100 more than that, at $16,800, we have Mariah. Nice, nice. Mariah. Uh -huh. And in the top spot with a whopping $18,900. Who's it gonna be? Who, who, who's left? For Camilla. Wow. Oh, thank you. That's, That's hey, a my lot girl, of Rich. money. That's a lot hey. of <laughs> My girl, Ridge, baby. Oh. Mm, don't talk to me anymore. Okay, so we're gonna go into the finale process and this is how it works. In front of you, you have a green light. If you're in the top five, your light will stay green. If you're in the bottom five, your light will turn red. Alexa, make the lights green. Let's be honest here. My heart is beating so fast. I don't know if I'm in the top five. I don't know uh, if I came in dead last. I literally have no idea, and I'm just sitting there hoping for the absolute best. Look, y'all, I know I've been kind of negative towards myself the whole time. Like, nah, I'm not going to win. I'm going to lose. But I think I'm going to make the top five for sure. All these green lights in front of us are really super intimidating. We're all standing in front of one, and yeah, I'm really nervous at this point now. You guys, I'm literally praying to Diosito right now. I am hoping that my light does not turn red. I'm so nervous. I feel good. I should I should be in the top five. I have to have at least made top five. I mean, like I said, I had the quickest time in the Zorb. There's no way anyone beat me on that. I've been in like first or second place this whole time, so I'm hoping I at least made it to the top five. Otherwise, kind of embarrassing. Right now, I'm in um, a pretty serious move because there's a lot of money to be made right here, and um, I want it a lot. I am freaking the fuck out. I'm so nervous. We've been waiting for so long. All I'm hoping is that I at least make it into the top five. <laughs> oh, okay, look. Now, nah, who do we got? We got Kane, Christian, 
Mariah, sorry, Lava Girl, Taylor, and Louie. Let's go. What a squad. Shut up. I'm sorry, guys. If sorry, your light, guys. it's okay. Yeah, there you go. Sorry to see those lights go red. Guys, if your light is currently red right now, that means you are walking away with absolutely nothing. We are sorry. I have $10. I'm okay. Okay. It's okay. Season one, I'm out first round. Season three, I don't even make it to the top five. What the f is going on? My heart literally dropped right to my ass and I wanted to cry. The tears didn't come out, I held them back, but it was not a fun moment, let's just say that. Well, I did not make it to top three, but I am very excited for everyone else. I have a couple winners that I am voting for in my head. I didn't make top five, but I had a great experience. Wouldn't take it back for the world. Uh, just happy I was here. It's okay, Zach. You really played your heart out. Haley, no sweat. Peter, we'll get him next time. I am kind of shook to see everyone that is on the top five, including me, but I cannot believe that Peter did not make it to top five. That I was not expecting. Yeah, what a scrub. <laughs> Could never be me. <laughs> You know, bomb, little disappointed myself, but I am so happy for every single person that placed above me. Did not make top five, so like I said, embarrassed, but I'm excited to see who wins. I don't know. I'll be happy for whoever. I'm still confused on how this is working. Camilla had the most money. Now she's out. <laughs> Did I miss something? Louie, your light is green. <laughs> how you feeling? I honestly was not expecting it. I swear, like, I thought it was going to be red, so I'm kind of... I'm surprised. Wow. <laughs> you guys, I am top five. I'm literally like shook right now. The fact that I made it to top five and I was not believing in myself, I made it. I made it to top five. I'm top five. I made it. I mean, yeah, I, I should have, but, but this is where it gets intense. Okay, top five. I made it into the top five. Fingers crossed. Maybe I'll make it into top three. There's just one yellow light in the distance. <gasps> it can't be. Fousey tube. <laughs> Kane, tell me how you're feeling, boy. I'm a happy camper, man. I got a green light. <laughs> I can see by that smile. Christian, again, bro. Again. 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 I tried. I tried. Once, I once, I tried. One time, okay. one time. One time. One time for the double green. Oh, come on, Kane. Really? Again? Bro, Kane, man, with the disrespect. God, that hurts. So right now I'm in the top five, and honestly, not too worried, not too worried. I'm pretty confident I'm gonna get this one. Why won't this motherfucker just shake my hand? <laughs> He's got a good meme going, you know, might as well keep it going. I'm trying to be a good sport here. Like I'm trying, it's, it's not that serious. Just shake a damn hand. Christian, you know, always just trying to shake my hand. But uh, look, I'm a very competitive guy and, um, you know, leave me alone. <laughs> Fox. I'm still green and all I can think is, holy shit, this is actually happening. If I just lost right now, I'd be so content because I made it farther than probably most people thought I would. Okay, now it is time to reveal the top three. You know how it works. If your light turns red, that means you are not in the top three. If it stays green, that means you have a chance to be the winner of Reality House season three. All right, your top three of Reality House season three are. Christian, Lava Girl, and Taylor, the final three. See you later, everyone else. Peace out. I was wrong with my Louis prediction all the way back in episode one. He was probably a fan favorite for a lot. Wow. Here we go. Nice. So now I'm top three and shit's getting real. My body is literally in shambles and I'm going against Taylor and Christian. And to me, they worked so hard. Taylor came in so strong and she got to redeem herself. Christian came in so late and redeemed himself. I wish them the best. I, if I lost now, I wouldn't even be upset. They deserve it. I just realized Kane is gone, man. No, Kane, dude. <sighs> okay, top three, top three. 
Mariah and I are holding hands now. It's me, Mariah, and Christian. I'm one step closer to finally winning this thing. Hopefully this time I come in first place and not second place. These are the people that I had voted from the jump that we're gonna win. I knew Taylor was gonna be up there. No shot, she wasn't. I'm happy for all of them, honestly. They all they deserve it. They all played well. Fair game. Cause I'm up here top three and we have Taylor who, you know, obviously should be here. She is a competitor, but then you have Mariah up here, Lava Girl, like, that's a slow, well-played game. What? Well done, Lava. Well done. <laughs> Lava girl, are you kidding me? Bro. Christian just made top three. I'm feeling really proud, hoping he makes number one because maybe I'll get a cut. She just dates him for like a week after the show, takes his money, and then pieces out. See ya, Christian. Yeah, my, my fucking light turned red. Some bullshit, but um, you know, I, I honestly, uh, I played my heart out on these, uh, these competitions and, you know, you win some, you lose some. Gotta pat myself on the back, top five. You know what I would like to see? Christian just absolutely rip Kane apart right now. Just turns to his left. Oh, you see that, Kane? Huh? You little puss boy? Remember you were talking all that smack? Uh, here's my hand, psych. Ah. I did not make it to top three, but we have two girls and Christian on the top three. I'm just so happy with the top three. Mariah, T, and Christian, y'all did that. I'm super happy for you guys. Now I'm even more anxious to find out who is gonna win. I think mine's Hold broken. <laughs> <laughs> Look at Kane's face, bro. <laughs> Ah, uh, Louie, you're now red. How you feeling, man? Wait a second. I'm just realizing right now that Tana, Bryce Hall, and Tube were all on this show at some point. It feels like a fever dream, man. Like, do you guys remember that? I know it was only a couple weeks ago for you guys, but it feels like a year ago. It doesn't even feel like the same season. Hey, Uber's here. <laughs> I mean, I'm happy at least I was in the top five because I was not even expecting to be in the top five, so... I'm happy that I at least made it to top five. Okay. You did really good. I'm proud of you. Thank you. Just starts roasting JC. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, dude. Go back on Twitter shilling those NFTs. Well, you know, wh wh why don't you compete in your own little games, huh? Kane, you're now red as well. Uh, how you feeling? A little disappointed? <sighs> Sorry I let you guys down. Um, congratulations on the three contestants. You guys did great. Thank you, man. For sure. Except for you, Christian. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> That's some sportsmanship right there. Now, I'd like to say quickly, uh, our top three contestants right here are, are walking away with something tonight. So that's good. Dude, I gotta pee. This is taking too long. Better than last year. There you go. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> we changed it up. We won three winners this season. Okay. So, for the top three, we thought we'd do a little song special. Nope. Do a little K&J. You know what it is. Twist. It's not a, it's not a twist, but... It's not really a twist, but... We thought we'd say something special about you guys because you deserve it. What would you do if he looks directly at the camera? He's like, Philion, thank you so much for providing all of this joy and laughter to the viewers of The Reality House. Not only did you drive more eyeballs onto our content, but you made The Reality House an event for everyone involved. Christian, you came in super late. You had a lot of catching up to do. And uh, you had a lot to prove, and I think you did that by being in the top three. So for that, I'm proud of you. Mariah. Hello. You've been here the whole time. I sure have. Yeah, and you've oh, been geez. killing it. Thank you. Very under the radar. Yep. Um, I've been in the interviews and around the house and just, you know, behind the scenes on everything. There's never been one bad word about you. Oh, yes. And you played the game very, very well. Thank you. Of course. Thank you. And I love you. <laughs> Will you be my girlfriend? <laughs> if you don't say yes, you're not gonna be number one. Taylor. Got me again. Hmm. Season two, you fell a little short. You got second place. So you also had a lot to prove coming into this season as a newcomer and having a second shot. Mm -hmm. For that, we are very, very proud of you. Thank you. All right, here we go. Here we go again. <laughs> okay. Before this happens, um, number three's light will not go red, okay? Yeah. Um, because they are walking away with some money. Third place will be walking away with $5,000. It's pretty good. Yeah. It's all right. <laughs>
kidding. It would be sick if the person in first place was like, you know what? I don't need the money. Let's distribute it amongst all the contestants for all their hard work. Better yet, I'm going to donate my portion to the less fortunate. If somebody did that, I think I would shit an actual brick. Person in third place is... Christian CV. Congratulations. Oh, my boy, Christian. You guys see Lava Girl and Taylor? Ah, you got fucking voted off. It's me or you. It's me or you. Yes. Thank you, guys. You're you owe me $5,000. I'm, I'm grateful for third place, but I just feel like it was the luck that did it to me. I got bad luck. And that's just how it is, but... Still blessed. Would be sick if he came in like he did late in the show and just stole first place. Be a good arc, not gonna lie. Congratulations, Christian. Crazy. You are $5,000 richer, but that leads us down to this. Once again, it is a girl winning season. Let the women do the work. The girls are yeah, running, running the season up. I like it. It's Mariah and I, and we are literally standing there in awe. I mean, we're surrounded by so many, like, strong men. You know, there's Peter, there's Christian, there's Kane, there's Zach. There's all these guys that we thought, you know, were a big competition. And here we stand, hand in hand, two women. I wouldn't have it any other way. I'm still just super shook. I'm shaking. And... The fact that it's two women, Taylor and I, at the top just makes it even better just because we had girl power, we stuck by each other, and we really just persevered together. She opened up to me, I opened up to her. It just, it couldn't have been any more perfect. Go off, queens. Yes! Get that bag and dip! Before we announce the winner, would you guys like to say anything to each other? Oh yes, of course. Taylor, I am so beyond happy that you were able to redeem yourself and you showed us how beautiful and kind and giving you are. And I am just very happy that you are by my side right now. And Mariah, I think that you are one of the strongest, most powerful women that I've ever come in contact with. I love being around you and I'm so glad that I got to meet you and spend so much time with you. And I know that this friendship will last, so I'm Congratulations, if you win, and good luck, and I'm just really proud of you. Smack Simba off her head. Okay. That was beautiful. That was awesome. Thank you. It's coming down to this. <laughs> God, it's the reality house, man. I just love it so much. And taking home $51,800. Mariah. Mariah. <laughs> Lava Girl did it. It was Lava Girl. Oh my lord, it was Lava Girl. Nah, that's cool. I mean, she played well. She spelled the word. It's really what it boils down to. $51,000. 51 G's. 51 smackaroos. I cannot, I can't even put my thoughts together. And I just actually won. And I am so, I'm so shaking. I can't believe it. I. I did it, dude. Someone give me my check. There she is. I'm so excited, guys. I I really told myself I was going to win the whole time, but like when you actually win, you're like, holy shit. I still have no words. I feel like my reaction is going to hit me way harder later. I'm still super in shock, but Brad, we're going to the steakhouse, baby. What went on between Lava Girl and Brad? I just got to know. Brad's also a vegan. Yeah, have fun. I want to can you freaking believe it? Like, I'm literally losing my mind. I, I'm i literally on cloud nine. I, I feel so humbled. And yeah, I'm just really excited. Yes, Mariah, let's go. You have been just the sweetest, very kind. No one's had anything bad to say about you all season. Congrats to you. And I got third place. It's a, it's a good night. It's a good night. Just 
We're so, so happy. She deserves it. We are so stoked. And um, yeah, she deserves it. 100%. I'm sorry for sleeping on you, Mariah. I didn't, I didn't think you had it like that, but good shit. Hell yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> Man, the way this kid talks really is something special. Mariah won it. <sighs> She deserved it, man. I had a feeling, I had a feeling she had it in the bag. Uh, today, her demeanor changed. She really was in it to win it. I gotta give it to the girl. She really killed it today. I'm so proud of Mariah, like so proud. She's just such a badass bitch. I'm just so ecstatic for her. I am so proud of Mariah, dude. Her warrior spirit just elevated the reality house to a new level. No other competitor can even compete with Lava Girl. Are you kidding me, dude? She's the best. She deserves to win. I'm so happy for her. Mariah, AKA Lava Girl, congratulations. Holy shit, you just won $51,800. That's insane. Kane is just like, <laughs> Lava Girl, I knew you had it in you. Where my hug at? Where's my hug, Lava Girl? No, Kane, I'm good. Wow, Mariah, you did that. Holy shit. Oh my God, $50,000 added to your bank account. A ver, donde nos vas a llevar a comer? I am so freaking proud of you, girl. You did that. She was really like under the radar the whole time. I feel like she knew she had this and she was kind of keeping it to herself. So I definitely feel that a lot of people are surprised, but very well deserved. I love you. Thank you. Oh, my mask. Let's go. Okay, sorry. Oh my god. Uh, I wanna, I wanna give a big shout out to all you guys. Um, thank you so much. Literally, uh, Key and I, we, you know, we try to set the bar high on our shit, and um, I don't know. I'm just really happy and proud of everyone here. And I know I'm blabbing on, but I love you guys. So I think thank what you. he's trying to say is, without you guys, this show would not be a thing. Philion, shout out Philion. Great videos, dude. Love it. If everyone could just go and subscribe to Philion, he made this show what it is today. His videos are absolute bangers. Uh, we'd also like to say uh, a huge thank you to our team. Without you guys, none of this would be filmed. Best crew ever. Uh, we love you. We appreciate you. And last but not least, we want to thank everybody watching at home. Uh, without you guys, we wouldn't have a show either. We love you. We appreciate you. We want to say thank you. And from the bottom of our hearts, we love what we do, and we ain't gonna stop, baby. We ain't gonna stop, Playboy. This has been Reality House Season 3, and we will see you next time. Next time. Uh, did we get sponsors for Season 4 yet? Are we clear to say that? No? We used up all the money? Do we have to say time next time? Oh, okay. Next time. Peace! Thank you, guys. All the contestants gave a heartfelt speech on what an amazing experience the reality house season three was. And I figured, you know what? Why don't I do the same? Listen, a lot of you guys are probably used to me making a certain type of content, and this is a little new for you. And I appreciate everyone that stuck around from episodes one through 10. I've had a lot of fun making these videos. And to be honest, I like to change it up. I want to show you guys what I'm capable of outside of being put into a box. And I like to think we achieved some of that. So if you laughed at any time, cracked a smile, or even forcefully exhaled at of your nostrils and hey, I did my job. I'm really excited to show you guys what I'm actually capable of in terms of content creation and I hope you stick along for the ride. Well, it's been a pleasure everybody. After all the twists and turns, the drama, the fights, the love and the tears, we've made it to a bittersweet end. K and J, you put on one hell of a show and I am proud to have been a part of it. This is Cromity. Signing out for Reality House Season 3. Yo, third eye. Next time on Reality House. You already know what's up!